Short stories for kids A short story between an ant and a frog Once upon a time an ant and a frog lived near the river The ant and the frog were close friends they both were chatting always and playing near the river One day the ant asked the frog for a ride across a river The frog agreed but warned the ant not to speak Halfway across the frog heard the ant whispering The frog got angry and threw the ant into the river. The ant struggled to survive in water. Suddenly a bird appeared and dropped a leaf near the ant. The ant climbed up the leaf and safely reached shore. The ant realized that Not everyone who appears friendly can be trusted. A short story between a bear and a rabbit. Once upon a time, a bear and a rabbit lived in the forest. One sunny afternoon, the bear was out for a walk in the forest. On the way the bear saw the rabbit who looked worried The bear being friendly asked the rabbit what was wrong The rabbit said a cunning fox was hidden behind the bush it's trying to eat me The bear growled at the fox the fox scared and ran away to save its life The bear said, "Now you can go back to your home safely." The rabbit told, "I lost my way and afraid I would never find my burrow." The bear, being kind-hearted, offered to help the rabbit search for its burrow. They both searched all the way. Finally, They found the burrow and the rabbit was overjoyed. The rabbit thanked the bear and invited to eat some delicious food. The bear happily said, "It's my favorite food." From that day on, the bear and the rabbit became good friends. A short story The clever crows Once upon a time a pair of crow lived on a tree A snake lived in the same tree One day the crows went out in search of food The snake crawled upon the tree and ate some of the eggs It happens every day when the crows return back. The crows felt very sad and it's thinking how to save the eggs from the snake. The crows got an idea to trick the snake and save the eggs. The crow decided to go to the river where the royal family comes to take bath. The crow took their necklace and flew from that place. The guards chased the crow. The crow threw the necklace into the snake's hole. The guards killed the snakes and took the necklace from the hole. From then on, the crows lived happily on the same tree. Subscribe Kids entry and enjoy with 
kids and tree videos.